Welcome back to Life and Style. Art is what we do every single Tuesday. And this is Paintbrush. Thank you so much, Aisha, for, for giving us a great time and a great show on performing arts. That was beautiful. And just so you know, I went to Kangemi Primary School uh, for my class one, I think. That was class one. For units or class one. One of those ones. So, yeah, I'm proud of uh, Abraham Shiletu. Big up yourself. Okay. Karibuni. <laughs> How are you, Kamau um, and Lukamba? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Today we're talking paint. Yes. And, and this is beautiful. I've seen some pieces here at my desk career. I don't know how many gifts are you going to by the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I'll start uh, with you. Uh, maybe a bit of background yeah. in the arts industry. When did you get into it? Yeah, my name is Kamau Joroge. Mm -hmm. uh, I started art after, from a small age. My father has some background from art. Yeah. So as a child, he, I started playing with his stuff. And so I started learning from there. I drew cartoons. And he always encouraged me, no matter how, how primitive they looked, mm -hmm. I, he kept motivating. And so that kept me growing. And during my high school, uh, in St. Joseph's, uh, we did challenges among friends. Mm -hmm. and Who were also artists. Yeah, because okay. we didn't have uh, uh, art lessons, art classes in school. Mm -hmm. We found a way out. We started making competitions among ourselves. So this week I was like the best. Next week somebody else is very good. And I knew from there I didn't want to do anything else apart from art. And I, I did, and I joined Kenyatta University mm. and did my major in painting. And I'm in my fourth year. Whoa. Yeah. Wow, that's really good. Yeah, like think, you took it and went all yeah. the way with it. Yeah. That's and, really good. And during my attachment, I met Pascal mm -hmm. Chuma, who is now, uh, he's in the industry for some time. He's a very good artist. Mm -hmm. And that, that's how I, I started getting into the art industry. Okay. Yeah. Lukamba. Thank you. <laughs> Niembi, Ulianza, uh, where did I you start? Started... Where did you even discover that oh, yeah. you could be an amazing artist? Long ago. There was a time <clears throat> when Super Strikers was on yes. everywhere. Remember yes. That time? yes, I remember. So I was the guy who used to buy them and go and trust them. You see? He started <laughs> by trusting, not even drawing the real stuff. I don't know many people were doing I think we liked his hair. Yeah. His yes. hair was yes. really Seven. the football stuff. Yeah. That was in class four. Uh -huh. Then I just wanted to go and do something about art. My mom was like, okay, you can do it. We look for a school. Then when I finished um, primary, I went to Kibabi High School. It has art. After that, I did it. I'm you know, from four. So they were looking for a school that has art, art. for you to join? In fact, it was Big art and basketball because I liked basketball also. Oh, okay. So it was art and basketball. Yeah, Kibabi is known for basketball as well. Yes, yes. Yeah. So I did, I did art there, mm -hmm. finished it, and got a good grade. It allowed me to go to KU. I also wanted to pursue art because I really wanted to be able to paint people. One of my main aims was just to paint my mom because she's like my role model. That was what I wanted to achieve in life. Did you try before becoming quite the professional that no, you No, I told are? my mom, you wait. You don't, you don't have to rush. I want to be perfect first before I draw you. Okay. So I went to Kenyatta University and maybe second year, third year there. I was exhibiting at Natural Museum before. Mm. In fact, right now they're having a, a, an exhibition. An exhibition. It's supposed to be on Friday. Okay. Yes, on Friday. So I met Pascal. He uh -huh. told me, you know, you're supposed just to be at school. You can also learn about the market. And now wow. Pascal told me that art sells. You can make money through art. I didn't know. Just like, uh, maybe I'll do a painting of someone I like. Uh, and then they will be happy uh, and you're happy. happy. Yes, yes. Okay. But after some time, we went to Bobea. We saw what he had done. He told us more about art, about the market, which we weren't told at school. And then after that, I went with my brother here. We went to Bobea and yeah. got the chance to do attachment there. After you did that, your attachment there? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now we are both in fourth year doing painting as a major and we are almost finishing at yeah, almost done. Congratulations, that's really good. Thank because you. there's art, then there's perfecting it and getting skills yeah. that yes. will put money yeah. to the passion that you have, which is very, very important. Yeah. Yeah. Just to clarify, mm -hmm. every single painting that we have on the set today yes. is something that you have done. done. Yes. Yeah. This is commendable. Thank so you. can you imagine after you clear what's going to happen? So have you sold a piece since you started? Uh, or how many pieces? I've lost count of how many pieces. What? 
That's really good. Yeah. Uh, as, a, as, an, as an artist, as, as a student who is an artist, mm -hmm. you can't be broke for so long. You, you do a piece, you sell. So it, it's, a good, it's a good journey. It's, a, it's enjoyable. No matter how much stress, there's too much stress in school, but you enjoy because it's passion that drives you there. No matter how hard it becomes, mm -hmm. you have an inner force that drives you to, to creating more and more. You feel the urge to create. All right. Yeah. You talked about drawing people, <coughs> and particularly your mom. Did you ever get to do it? Yes, I finally did. Where uh, is it? It's, it's not here. It's not here. It's not here. She has it. She has in it. In fact, she just put it in her bedroom. She doesn't want, like, she wakes up in the morning and sees and say, oh, my son has done something. Oh, good Lord. Yeah. So is it just her face that you wanted to draw on? Or a what, portrait, what's, a sorry? portrait. It's called a portrait. Oh, yeah, it's a portrait. Here, so a do, do, is that what you just do? Portraits? No, I do, I do, I do almost anything. Okay. Mostly I deal with realism. Like, you can see, um, I did a lion. Yeah. Also, I did a Maasai. Those are some of the works I did. Yeah, yeah, quite captures the detail. Thank you, thank you. The, the, yeah, the realism is quite evident, you can see that. So majorly, is that what you like doing, <clears throat> realism, portraits? Yes, realism and portraits. Okay. Also, I like to express my brush talks in the realism part mm. of it, yes. Absolutely. Uh, what, what, what is it that you love to do? <laughs> uh, for me, uh, I'm not as like him. I don't, I'm not into too much detail. I love to express, I love expressive strokes of brush and paint. So I'm an expressionist painter. I follow the expressionist movement. Uh, yeah, okay. some of my pieces, you, if can, you will. You can just grab it. If, oh, so that okay. I, I, I can see. Mm -hmm. There, okay. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, you, if you looked at it there, you will find so many brush strokes that uh, I, I yeah. Yeah. I, I I love texture on my um, on my work. Mm -hmm. I I don't like if I I'm against realism. Uh, You're against? No, I, I'm not as a, as, a, as, as I do artist. it as an artist because yeah. especially hyper realism. I think of I, I won't even go there. Uh, <laughs> Just put uh, this back because uh -huh. there's photography mm -hmm. and. So brush strokes, they, they, I feel they are more expressive and yeah, I, enjoy, I enjoy that more. There's something about hyperrealism that is yeah. so neat yeah. and captures the detail. Yeah. Why, why do you not like it? Uh, <laughs> I, I don't, for me, doing it, I don't like okay, doing, doing it. Okay, doing it. I would love a few pieces in okay. my house. All right. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. now I get it. Yeah. You were going for the defense there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> please go, take it away. Um, Realism is something very nice <laughs> because it takes a lot of time just to get somewhere these eyes. Leave alone the, the whole face. Okay. Like the eyes, the eyes themselves. Yeah. Give them the detail. But someone can look at a distance and say, is that a picture? Is that a painting? That's what I want to achieve. Mm. That's what I do achieve. Okay. And I'm glad I do. Into the details, into yeah. the beauty of the strokes. The, stroke. and yeah. will, the strokes give you the feeling of the artist, how... Mm -hmm. What I was feeling, if I was angry, you will find very expressive strokes. Oh yeah? yeah, are they the long ones or short ones? I, I wouldn't even understand if this art is not <laughs> angry, uh, unless should, those ones just do this and this and this and you this. You should visit our 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 place, our yeah. studios, and okay. and you will have you will have an experience. Okay, totally. Yeah. Where are the studios? Uh, we we based at Bobea, Bobea Art Center. Mm -hmm. It's in Donholm. Okay. Uh, next to Donholm Primary. All right. Yeah. Let's talk about the money in the industry. First of all, he mentioned that uh, as a student, you're never broke. You're never broke. <laughs> because you, you do a piece and it's sold. Mm -hmm. But the industry in, at large yeah. and people appreciating, um, loving and, you know, value for money mm -hmm. for the kind of art that you put on canvas. How is it? It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. That's not a... That's uh, I, I remember there was a time. I was so heartbroken. Uh, my mom just got me a laptop. And somebody stole it. And she was like, ah, no, I can't give you another laptop. You say art pays. Go get your own laptop. <laughs> Through art. I was devastated. I, was, I didn't know what to do. She told me, um, I'll give you two clients. Your sister and me. Two clients. Drawers. I'll give you something. That's how I started. That's how, when I knew art has, has potential, has, has, has money. Okay. After that, I just took the samples from like, my sisters and showed it to her, her friends. And they were like, oh, I like this. Can you do this for me? 
After three months, I was able to buy my laptop and go back to school. Yeah. At phases. Well, okay. I've gone to, uh, I've gone to a few exhibitions, yeah. art exhibitions at the National Museum. And you'd look at a painting and wonder, do I look at it from this angle? What, what was he trying to say? Mm -hmm. And then people tell you, you, need, you don't need to be very close. Yeah. You need to stand a bit far so that you can see it. What is that about? Oh, I, I, for every artist, it's different. Yeah. But to feel, to, feel, to experience the, uh, some artwork, I, I think you need some space so that I, I, it comes in natural. You yeah, it give does. it some space and then experience the art. But there are people who can't see. Okay. <laughs> so, okay, it's not for everybody. Okay, true. It's, every, there is something for everybody. Mm -hmm. You For some who, who will understand abstract, some will hate abstract and love realism. realism yeah. So, there is something for everybody. However, it speaks to you. It's in your it's, own. It's, it's right. Your, yeah, it's yeah. right. For me, yeah. it is right. Yeah. We've talked about the good things, the money beat, and how it's been working so yeah. far for you guys. Let's talk about the challenges, Likamba. What are some of the biggest challenges that you've had? Um, appreciation since? sometimes. Yes. It's very hard. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yes. Especially here. Here? Yeah. In, in Kenya. Okay. Not life and style? No, no, uh, no, 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 no. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, Appreciation is, is very, very important because that's where you get your market from. Okay. And if they don't appreciate it, it means you can't get something. People want you to, to do things for free and they don't know that you're getting your canvas. You're being, uh, you have to go buy the canvas, you have to go buy the frame, you get buy the paints. People want uh, <laughs> to get them for free. That's true. The artwork is work, mm. yeah, so true. you should pay for Plus the work. Plus even the imagination, yeah. the time you take, the concentration. Yeah. Yeah. So, why, okay, why, what would you say is the problem? Because art has been there for a very yeah. long time. But in, in, in Kenya, for, for some of our elder parents, uh, they, they look down upon art and think that we should be, all be doctors, teachers, mm. and then they forget about we should be artists. <laughs> and that's, that's how we, we, we find some challenges because they don't want to pay the value for what you're giving sometimes, but where we're going, we, we're getting good responses and the future is very bright. Okay. Yeah. What's the most expensive piece that you've ever sold? Oh, uh, yeah. for me? Yes. Yeah. As you grow old as an artist, uh -huh. the, your work, you grow by skill and by the value of your work uh, appreciates. As for me, I'm still younger, so okay. I'm not still, I'm not, but of course, you've yeah. panda. Yeah. You've, you've lost count of the yeah. number of uh, paintings that you've sold. I have sold my, my most expensive by now. Is, no, let's. I think we should keep that and <laughs> so that. <laughs> so that yeah, just to show yeah, people that yeah. they can actually, you okay. know, yeah, as, a, as a student, the, the, the most expensive I've done is the 30k. Wow. Yeah. But there's a, you go to an exhibition, you'll find an M. I, 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 saw, I saw a lion, yeah. just like this, look yeah. up. I saw a lion. Yes. Well, yeah. on, a bigger, <laughs> on a bigger canvas, yeah. on a bigger canvas, and five, five, like half a name. I was like, yeah. okay. Lion. You know, I want to appreciate <laughs> art. <laughs> and for you, look up. Uh, the name behind is also important. Okay. Yeah. Like you're not buying the, 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 the 500 ah. work, you're buying the name of that person who did that work. Okay. That's the, the whole story behind it. Ah, mm. all right. Oh, personally, I sold around 20. They do portraits for 5 to 10K. Okay. Yes. Yeah. That's really good. The basic ones that you, we do, you'll find something from 8,000, 5,000. Yeah. And that's quite affordable. Yeah, to get yeah. your materials back. So yeah. by the time you, you finish school, yeah. become a Pascal, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. known Peter. Yeah. So this will go high. We'll get to 100 at some point. So actually, mm. art has money. Yes. There is money. Yes. You need, what, what do I need if I'm, a, if I'm an artist and I want to get to you know, the level that you are at or even better? For what is that you need, thing? You need support. Support. You need support. Because and if your parents tell you you're wasting your time, yeah. <laughs> that's the worst part. And uh, you need patience to okay. get something out of your head because you have the picture in your head. To the canvas, mm -hmm. you need a lot of patience because sometimes unapaka rangi in high tea, 
So oh, high tea. High tea. Okay. I behave. I behave. <laughs> so it discourages you. You you hate your painting. You, then you start loving it, and then. <laughs> After you love it, everybody else will love it. So it starts with you. It yes. starts with you. Have you, ever, have you. have you started a painting not knowing what it's going to look like at the end? Like uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes when you, uh, the times that you feel you're under stress, you feel distressed and you want, it's, painting is my way to vent out my, my emotion. Okay. So That's at good. times I will get a canvas that is primed and I will do something. I don't know what I will do, but, after I'm done, I, wow, I, I think I love this. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, we need to finalize this conversation. Okay. Okay. How can people get in touch with you for maybe a painting or even to learn more from you? Mm -hmm. Oh, um, I'm at Bobea at Center. You can find me there. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Um, both yeah, there. we'll be okay. both there. Facebook? Yeah, Facebook, I'm Kamau Joroge. Mm -hmm. And uh, Twitter, Kamau Joroge254. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh. We'll come back. Facebook, Zef Benza. Huh? Zef Ben Benza. Zef Benja. Ben. Short. Oh, Benja or Ben? Benza. Benja. And okay. it has a long story behind it. Oh, yeah? Uh, We're going to call you back for that story. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Time is up. So that's it for just Facebook. Yes. Facebook. You're not on Twitter, not on Instagram. Why? Same, oh, same. Instagram, Instagram is all about Instagram, this. Zef Benza. Like pictures and. Oh. Everywhere, Zef Benza. Okay, Instagram. everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's <laughs> I said, Tim. Thank you. Thank you. Well, this has been Paintbrush. We're taking a very short commercial break. When you come back, Aisha will be with you on visual arts, photography, and creative of the week. Don't go too far.